Today's show is proudly brought to you by YOLO Executive Baba and Spa. We are here with a man who's worked so hard to put Kumasi on the bigger map of Ghana. I'm talking about DJ Aroma. DJ Aroma, welcome to LMTV. You are my brother, thanks so much. You're welcome. I'm sure there are so many people who have heard of DJ Aroma. Mm. Well, perhaps they might be like me when they hear DJ Aroma, they think of a giant, huge, bigger wow. <laughs> personality. So who, who would you, in short, who would you say DJ Aroma is? Um, DJ Aroma is the DJ that you need for every occasion is that music um, figure. I'm even a, a, a musical instrument, if I, I'm to say. Oh, wow. You understand? I'm, I'm that guy who loves music so much, and it's evident in the work I do now. It wasn't music as a career from the beginning. It wasn't DJing, it was schooling, but later the passion was too big, so I had to enter DJing, and I'm, I'm oh, good, you know. That's great. So, would you say that the brand DJ Aroma is, is as successful as you expected it to be? Oh, if I should say, yeah, it's, it's penetrating that big. Some of us didn't expect it that much. As I said earlier, it was just a passion. I play music in the comfort of my room when I have nothing doing until I realize, hey, Charlie, they are not so mm. And now it's fetching money. So, success, the human wants are insatiable. Yeah. It's successful, but still, we are aiming for a greater height. Exactly. Yeah. When would you say was the breakthrough for Aroma? KNUST, mm. Republic Hall. Mm. I was the entertainment chairman for my hall, and there were numerous instances I had to be behind the console playing music. Oh. And one time I was playing music, and the DJ Slim mm. came around. There was an activation on campus. He came around, he saw me DJ, I was like, hey, small body RNA Buddha, Laden. Yeah, and that was a breakthrough for me. They just wow. had given me the platform, wow. you know. I'm not Kumasi based, mm. born and raised in Tema and all that. Oh, okay. So I'll say the breakthrough was when I met DJ Slim. Wow. And so I was he, projected out there. So is he still more like a, a bigger brother to you? Oh, of course. Like I look up to him. He's a bigger brother to me. Wow. He's a bigger oh, brother to nice. me. Talking about, you know, I thought you were a Kumasi based person. I mean, you were raised and, and born in Kumasi. No, 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 no. I've never been in Kumasi, if not for KNUST. Wow. Yeah, and, and I always say this, the kind of love Kumasi has shown me, I've never had that love in any part of Ghana. So I think you should look into the camera and tell them Kumasi oh, has love. Of course, love. <laughs> the love of Kumasi, I'm going to you. I don't know Kumasi, I don't know the chairman, I'm going to change the idea, but yeah. it's amazing, it's super awesome, if not for Kumasi, like who's Aroma? Charlie, mm -hmm. Charlie. Yeah. Kumasi is everything for me right now. So where, where are you originally from? I'm from Tema. Tema, as in, are, are you a Ashanti, a Ghan? Are you? I'm a Ghan. Like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So, what's, what's the Ghan hidden name that we don't know? Oh, my bad, you told you, Bali. Oh, one time we winning. Oh, did I get it right? Uh huh, uh huh, I figure. <laughs> I I'm pulled, Titi. I pulled a surprise for you and that. Oh, okay, so you figure that too. And just a little bit, not hey. much. <laughs> Aroma, you, you usually hear uh, YFM, you hear Aroma, you hear the Slims, you hear, and then all of a sudden, Aroma is no more with, with YFM. What, what, what happened? You see, um, there are times and seasons to everything. Yeah. And as a human being, you have to accept good and you have to challenge yourself. No doubt. I always believe, and I say this, everything you had wanted to be is on the other side of fear. Yeah. You shouldn't be scared to take any move. You have to risk it. You have to challenge yourself and make it. Exactly. So it was a new challenge, like the way in football, there's transfer season and all that. You have to move, accept new challenge, and go in for it. And we, we are told most of the most of the times, lots of DJs, mm. they, they love the job they do. Mm. However, mm. it's not solely, no matter what a radio station does, mm. when the move comes, they, they will take it. Mm. You see, there are a lot of factors, a lot of reasons why someone would move. Mm. One way or the other, me, Aroma, it's not just about the money. Mm -hmm. Money is not everything. 
But if you feel it's a good platform, as I said, you feel it's a new challenge, you can hop onto that to be a star to help you jump over to the other side. Why not? So would you say that Pure FM is a bigger platform than YFM? Really Sincerely. Because when, when you talk to somebody and there's a post, it means there's a hitting, <laughs> it means there's a hitting something. Would really? you say that Pure FM is a bigger platform? Look to the camera and tell us sincerely. Relatively, looking at the direction of my career now, um, DJ Arma is more of an outdoor person. I'm a radio personality. I DJ on radio, but I'm more of an event outdoor thing. And and Pure FM and that ABN has Angel FM as well. Likes more of those outdoor events, events kind of thing. And that that's the direction of my brand. So it's perfect area. Yeah. It's a new challenge. You have to challenge yourself. So we you have to start something. You know, Pure FM. <laughs> we, we start Pure FM afresh. Although it was a radio station oh, that was okay. existing, okay. afresh. Sometimes you have to test your strength. Mm. You have to know whether the people love you like how they say. Because exactly. is it is it? How would you know? Okay, I'm a YFM, but it could be because uh, YFM was built over time, and I also okay. came. So fine. I came to eat into the wow. listeners like that, but but PO is something new we all started, so wow. it actually helps you measure your strength. It makes, it makes yeah. a lot of sense. It's a huge So what, what, what genre of music would you say you are fond of? Do I even know? <laughs> Since I'm more of an outdoor DJ, mm -hmm. I normally stay in the face of the crowd and play what they want. Mm -hmm. That's how I am. In the comfort of my room, there are lots of things I listen to. I listen to gospel, life worship a lot, mm -hmm. but I mostly don't get a chance to play it unless I'm few wedding gigs. So I'm mainly about what the people want. Oh, okay. Mainly about when I'm on radio. Basically, sometimes it's my mood. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I want it, I want the trend that other DJs have played before me, mm -hmm. and I just stand out to be unique. So, so far, what has been your biggest platform outside radio? I mean, out out there for you. What has been your biggest platform? I can't mention one. Mm -hmm. I can't yeah, mention just, one. Just give us a few. Uh, MTN Paul's highest store, Sakode's highest store. Mm -hmm. Ga, um, Akra Kumase Takrade. Oh, okay. I know Akra Kumase Cape Coast, I was a headline DJ. Wow. Uh, Mr. Easy Dirty Wave Concert, oh. which had a lot of artists. I can't, I can't even mention all the names. I was a headline DJ as wow. well. Uh, what about Pekash Party with DJ Lambo, MI's official DJ. Uh, one DJ from South Africa, DJ Black, DJ Varoski, myself. So it, looks like, it looks like that the brand is moving so so far. Oh, by God's grace. Oh, thanks for that. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, that's good to hear. By God's well, you're putting the, the, you're putting the city on the map. And we, LMTV here, we thought it wise, sponsored by Yolo, mm. to give you a trick of, of a time. Uh, yeah, no, so I'm, the, I'm really enjoying it. I, I, hope, I hope it's not conflicting or it's not causing no, any... No, 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 no. <laughs> I wish it could happen every day like this. Wow. I just come and sit down and you be... Honestly, okay. because I, I told, I told, was it blessed mm. not long ago that I'm so not good at any of this. Oh, I, I, I'm not sure I can stand it any can stand better this. than you are. Is it because it's a, it's, a, it's a woman doing it? Well, <laughs> well, no, not really. <laughs> not really. Anyway, so would you say that in a, in a few years to come, mm. Arima would would still keep moving? From radio stations to another radio stations, or you're still you're looking at where you're going to get stuck for good. Oh, it, it depends. If, if if it's God's plan, you see, I, I don't just take decisions on my own. I pray about some styles, and if God God says God tells me one way or the other, Iron Man, there's a new place you have to go. Probably I have to. I can't do things my way because yeah. my thoughts are not his thoughts. Neither my ways is ways. So if God has predestinated the Iron Man, you end up at. PFM or at CFM. That's where I want God's direction, not my direction. Wow, that's that's nice to hear. He wants God's direction, not his direction. Any awards so far? Uh, Ghana DJ awards. I won best pub DJ of the year. Oh, Ghana, I think 2018, 2017. Yeah, talking about nominations, they're playing. Yellow executive Baba and Spa. Look here, come and be pumped. Aruma. Yes. Sir. How do you feel so far with the treat from Yellow? I feel like a king right now. Mm. A farmer me say. I wish this could continue every time. Yeah. I really, really like Yolo Beauty Spa. Yeah. It's a nice place to be, you know. You never disappoint. Oh, you never disappoint. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Marcel. Yeah. Thank you very much, Yolo. In education, where did Aruma get to? Or where is Aruma at the moment? Oh, so um, I do computer science in KNUST. Oh, okay. So I'm a degree holder, which I'll be continuing soon. You know, I was a Google student ambassador to Kenya, so oh, nice. there were sometimes Google had to fly me outside the country to wow. go and learn how to use Google Stars and come back. Wow. But the passion for DJing was so big. 
That even <laughs> wow. at some point you even got my siblings mad that ah Charlie like Ben, you? you are a smart guy. I'm mm. a computer science, you like Ben, DJ. Mm. But it's the passion, the passion yeah. is everything. And when the passion is there, you will pay in the, in the near future. Edumanis. And I'm sure he has paid. Edumanis. Edumanis. <laughs> That's right. Come on. Are you seeing any lady yet at the moment? Oh yeah, yeah I'm mm. dating. Wow, where where is she now? Where is she? Yeah. <laughs> She's around. <laughs> no, around around when you say around, where is around? She's in Kumasi. Okay, so can you guys see each other as often as possible? Oh, yeah, yeah. The see. job that doesn't cost anything. One way or the other, sometimes, you know, it's human. Mm-hmm. But it's all about priorities. It's what you complain? place about. Oh, she used to, but now. She's accepted. Now she's okay, yeah. Just like, just like when you started your, your dad disagrees, and when you start making the first money, it's like, that's my son. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> I'll send some of my videos. Yeah, that one part. Did you ever have that experience? Yeah. Oh, tell us about it. Yeah, on the moment my dad would just go and check me out on Facebook mm. and be showing it to my mom and they all be watching and laughing and she'll call me my dad will call me and be like, Ah, why why don't I send in some of my videos? Mm. I was like I said, What do I do? What kind of song I say, what, what do I do before when I clear a song? Mm. Everyone starts screaming. I was like, oh. It's the vibe, the vibe <laughs> of the song. So sometimes when there are nominations and I post on Facebook and I don't tell him, just mad. I was like, I'm nominated for something. I, I have to tell him so that he goes. I was like, hey, dad. I don't want to say I didn't mean you. Like, yeah. <laughs> you see, that's, that's, that's where determination takes us as, as humans. Exactly. That's where it takes us. And we have, we have seen the good work that you are doing and then we, we, we appreciate you. That's what this program is all about. Sure. We appreciate people who are putting, especially great people in Kumasi on the bigger map of Ghana. Sure. And we, we thought that you are one of these people and then we should give you a treat. Sure. We should let people know what exactly it is that you are doing. Sure. And now at Pure FM, uh, move from YFM to Pure yeah. FM. Yeah. And I'm sure it's, it's not been bad so far. Oh, it's been awesome. Like the kind of numbers all over social media trends, you know. I'm already from Mondays to Saturdays. Outdoor activations are superb. The finesse is everywhere, Charlie. It's like dreamland. You have no wow. idea. Wow. Wow. That's, that's for Kupu Kupu. Exactly. Oh, doctor. Okay. Doctor. Okay. Doctor. 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 <laughs> <laughs> that's nice to hear. Sure. We've had a wonderful time, and I'm sure that you will enjoy the rest of the treats. Sure. And before we leave, the mm. tradition, I always say, mm. must be continued. Mm. Do you have a, a, word, a word of uh, advice to people I totally disagree with people who say that they want to be like DJ Aroma. I believe that they should be inspired by what you do and be who they are. So you have a word, a few words for such people. So my word of advice out there to all the youth, you should follow your passion one way or the other. Education is first, but in as much as you are being educated, think about that thing that's deep inside you, that God gave you, what your heart bleeds for. That's what you are meant to be. If it's not something bad, go ahead and do it from the beginning it might not pay off but i'm telling you this for a fact if your dreams don't scare you then they are not big enough mm. there has been a couple of djs i have trained as well talking about dj lama of course he's out there and he's doing marvelous almost all the night clubs now you find dj lama there on the on the wild finesse all i can tell you out there is believe in yourself you can do it so i believe in god i don't believe in anyone else apart from god and god is my everything so all I can tell you is trust in God, take your prayers seriously, and everything your heart bleeds for will come to you. That's all I can say to all the young guys out there. Don't give up. Don't give up.